I'm blessing by name. I've been married now for six years. Please, I need help. Help me circulate this video to anywhere, to any human rights organization that can help me. Please help me. I need help. I've been married for six years now to an abusive man. This man beats me. This man locks me outside. This man refused to let me work. And then, even 5,000 Naira monthly allowance, he doesn't give me. At times, money to feed is a problem. I have to contact his spiritual father before his spiritual father can send money to me to feed. That's if I don't have money to feed. That's how pathetic it is. What I want the audience to do for me is to help me get out of this marriage. I am dying. There was a day he even strangled my neck. He said he's going to kill me. At every slight provocation, he must react. At every slight provocation, he must react. Even my kids, I have a kid of, of, of three years and five years. Before the presence of these kids, I go through this assault. The, the thing is just too much. It seemed like it would stop. It never did stop. It's only getting worse. While I'm doing this video, it's, I don't want any form of reconciliation with Mr. Precious. All I want from him is to, give, is to do what he needs to do. Take his responsibility for me to leave. He's not willing to take his responsibility because I want to leave. He is saying that if I'm leaving his house, I have to take responsibility of the kids and everything all by myself. That even a cent he's not going to give to me. So I'm, 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 and the court proceedings take time. It takes time for court proceedings. Bless everyone. I just want to, um, you may have come across some disturbing videos or some messages or some screenshots they may have sent you regarding my my marriage my home please i want you to this do know that yes there was an issue but we have settled everything we have settled everything yesterday we had a talk myself my in-laws and some well wishers we sat down we talked about everything I always respect um, home. Divorce is not of God, so we have we have we just want to we just want to notify the public that we have resolved issues. Uh, please um, pray for us and continue to stay in God's love. Okay. We love the body of Christ, mm -hmm. and and this should also serve as. Um, a lesson to every other person that nobody is perfect but if our imperfection arise we should always um, look for how to amend our ways that's, that's right. the most important thing make peace that's because right. there's no there's no joy in um, in, in disunity or in fighting that's all right. the social media issues and the rest of them there's no point doing that so, That's right. and continue to pray for us Pastor Benny Hinn, when he had issues with his wife he said something, he said he, ad he accepted to be a bad husband that he has been a bad husband because right. he was not listening to his wife that she talked and talked and talked he was not listening to her he was That's doing right. what he wanted mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. um, when she now saw when she um, put out the divorce notice and then he had to say no he cannot lose his marriage because of some of his imperfections of course and then he said he's ready to work on it and together with her he said they sat down they drafted out issues and they have settled and okay. they announced everyone that they have settled mm -hmm. so we are here to just let the public know that we have settled please continue to pray for us and if you feel offended by what you you watched or what you read please we are sorry 
God will bless you all. Please accept it. I love you all that showed me your love, your support. I love you all. Thank you so much for everyone, for your concern, for your calls, for your messages. We'll just notify you that it's been resolved. Thank you. God bless you. Bye-bye. Yes, yeah, so we have nothing to um, be worried about. We are okay. We are blessed. We are we are marching forward and the gate of hell shall not prevail. I and my wife, we are loving couples. And it's normal for couples to have um, differences and when they have the differences, they said to it, it just unfortunately became, it became a public uh, issue. We thank God for everything. We resolve our issues. I'm not a woman beater and I will never want to be one. God bless everyone. I love you. Bye-bye. Shalom.